whoa I hit record a job, you can't ignore it I'm transforming now these cars and planes, I'm always boarding Just out touring down Okay, so right now I have the ignition coil rack off As you can see right there I have this whole rack off with all the ignition coils I'm just trying to read room so I can get to the headers Down there, you probably can't see it, it's down there I'm um, trying to get room for the headers, so I'll probably start removing small stuff like this. I tried to jack it off the floor, as you can see right here, with my Pro Eagle jack. I couldn't get it high enough to ground since the car already sits so low um, to try and disconnect the drive shaft. So I'm just going to have to use um, what I have to work with. And then no, got the majority of the side off as you can see the headers right there what sucks is the bolts are kind of tucked in there so i can't really like ratchet any of the things out um i'll have to figure out a way to get those out i hit recorded jump you can't ignore it i'm transforming now these cars and planes i'm always boarding just out touring down in charlotte like i play for hornets when i'm performing never boring now you can't afford it champagne perrier finish friends on my face all right, I'll kind of show you where I'm standing. Um, so right down there, you'll kind of see the exhaust manifold and that this tubular piece right here. Um, so there's a little bolt right there. I can't get out, um, and I don't know really know how they designed it, but that's kind of where I'm standing, so I'm still trying. Looking like I'm from the D. D's no Cartier's. Pockets deep, 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 bro. I can make it in my seat, bro. Do you and do me, bro. Those are the bolts right there, and I think the other header of the bolts are right there. I'm actually struggling to even hold the camera because the BMW is already so low, so I have it jacked up with my Pro Eagle jack. So I'm going to try and get this done right here. Alright, so I kind of started by watching a couple YouTube videos on seeing how other people did it, and I guess I'm after this, I'm just going to go straight to the motor mount, which I have easy access to right there. And uh, yeah, let's get to it. Finally out, we got this right here. And I know over in that time lapse right there, that might seem like super easy, but I got like scratches all over me just trying to get this stuff out. Um, but yeah, it's just this little piece right here. It's actually pretty light, but yeah, it's this piece right here. And then on the other side for the motor mount, it's right there. So I might have to take this off or something like that, but we'll figure it out. That's me. Neighborhood do the dance. Neighborhood do the deal. Okay, thought I'd never make it like no way. I'm the real deal, no role play. My days off, that's no days. No, I hustle hard, young rose. E be the shooter, that's cold case. Those on the deals, that's rose. Got no pay, you no say. Okay, this the news, tell them read it. Been the one since the fetus. Don't sleep on me, Temple Pedic. That's a no, no, no. Spend the dope for no reason. Got a ball head, Mr. Clean. Okay, so currently we just took this um, transmission mount or transmission truss support bar, whatever you want to call it, off. And then we have this one connecting to the muffler to the tranny, so I just got this bolt loosened up and then... Big bags overseas then, we gonna go, go, go. Okay, so um, while we were filming the rope snaps, we switched to a chain. We tried to get the motor out, then shortly realized that the steering rack is blocking the motor from coming out. You probably can't see. But uh, so right now, I'm going to start by taking off the rack and pinion and then probably dropping the sway bar if I have to, and then the motor should be able to come out. All right, I got the rack and pinion out. Let's see how this goes. <laughs>
Okay guys, it's time. Um, I had to go charge my phone, but other than that, there was a couple fuel lines I hadn't disconnected yet, and a couple lines, almost like this one that I haven't connected. Um, yeah, hold on. Okay, boom. There's that. I didn't know that would come off that easy. And, uh, alright. Okay, it's, I think it's time. Just like that, guys. There she is. She's a big girl. Yeah. Long days of work. Um, so we're going to be LS swapping this uh, just out of a 5.3 or a 6.0. <sighs> Let us know what you think. This is part one. This is going to be series. So follow for the next episode. And we'll see you then.